The following is the construction uh, demonstration for construction three, in which we are to construct an angle congruent to a given angle. For example, let's start with this angle A here. What I will do, uh, what we will do is to construct an angle congruent to, give, to this uh, angle A. Okay? Now, what I will do first, I will uh, construct a ray, make it long enough, of course, and pick a point on this ray that is correspond to point vertex A there. Let me call this A prime, that this correspond to that vertex A. Okay. Now, of course, you kind of try to imagine or project that this ray here should be longer than the, the one here. Okay. Now, what I will do next is I will grab my compass with pivot point uh, pivot leg uh, place at A with a certain opening big enough not too small I will swipe through these two legs here the legs of the the angle okay let me make it more visible okay now that's why the pencil of your compass need to be sharp now then, using the same opening, I will go to A prime. I put that pivot leg at A prime, and I will do pretty much the same. Uh, uh, using the same opening, I swap it big enough. Okay, this opening here is approximately larger than the one there. Okay, so very good. Now then, I want you to realize that we are creating two points on this original angle and let's call this now point B and point C now uh, can you say something about this point here the one here yes that's our B prime the copy of point B there okay the point that is correspond uh, correspond to point B there now then I will use my compass now this time the pivot leg will be placed at B and I try to catch C on the other leg okay now this time it has to be precise no that's not good enough yes this is the one I want okay it passes through C with this opening now then that's what I use here Okay, I put it at B prime. It's in the same opening. Okay, you see that? Now, that's the copy of point C. Mm, let me put it here. That's my C prime. Okay. Now, then I will create a ray from A prime now to C prime. A prime to C prime. Voila, we now copy angle A. We already now just finished constructing an angle, in this case A prime, that is congruent to a given angle, in this case angle A. Okay, now let's see. What did we do first? If we summarize this, what I did first, I create a ray there okay and then with a certain opening that cuts through two legs of that ray I swap it there but I need to put the marking okay I need to put the marking I swap it here now the arc that intersect one ray you call that the uh, B prime in this case and then using an opening here you copy it there that's how you get your C prime okay now uh, this is the, the construct, uh, construction 3 now before I repeat this in another situation I want you to be aware that this is actually oh, this construction 3 is also a way for us to uh, copy a triangle 
if I give you a triangle ABC, for example, uh, what you will do first, you draw a line, right? And then you catch the opening of B. You copy it there, right? And then you ca catch the opening for C. You copy it there, uh, and so on. Okay. Now uh, I will uh, demonstrate that to you uh, later on. But for now, let's see this again. Suppose I have an angle maybe this time I do it this way let's say now I have angle uh, X here this is my vertex X and I want to copy this angle X what I will do first I will draw I will construct a ray maybe like that and let's call this point here the copy of X X prime and this is the ray okay now then <coughs> I will use my pivot point a uh, pivot leg of the compass to create an arc on that angle which I copy here okay now if I call this uh, maybe Y and this is C then I can call this my y prime. Okay. Now what I need to do is to copy the opening here from y to z. Now this is the one that we need to make it precise. Okay. From y to z. The intersection there is our C prime. That's the one I will bring. Oh, okay. Okay, this is my now my C prime. Okay, voila, we are now done with copying angle X. Okay, now this is construction three in which we are to construct an angle congruent to a given angle.